Hello and welcome to my channel. For those of you who don't know me, I'm Steph and today we have another very exciting video because we're trying out another new indie brand. And the name of that brand is Madage Beauty. Now Madage Beauty, their motto is that they are a brand for everyone. So uh, very inclusive, very exciting. Now I was very fortunate to receive a few of the products from their A Secure Romance collection in PR. So let me just show you what I have to try first. So we have here the Lip Envy Lip Balm. It's uh, strawberry flavoured, flavoured, smelly. Mmm. That smells beautiful. I'm going to pop some of that on now. Just uh, let's give that a go. Oh. Oh, that feels really nice. Hmm. Yeah, feels really nice. Smells delicious. Um, now the Lip Envy Lip Balm retails for £13.50. That's obviously UK pounds. And uh, how cute is this little tub? You get quite a lot of product in there. Hmm. Nice moisturised lips. So let's carry on. I'll show you the products first and then we'll get into using them. Firstly, you can get gift sets in this collection. There's an Eyes of Beauty set and a High Shine lipstick set. The, the Eyes of Beauty set retails for £42 and the High Shine lipstick set retails for £44. And these are the boxes that the sets come in. Really cute reusable boxes. So the other products I received in my PR package, firstly, there is this High Shine lip gloss clear lip gloss which we will try a bit later on and um, the lip gloss retails for £17. We have two lipsticks, the Sakura Shine lipsticks. I have the shades Tsubaki and Kanishon. I, I am terrible, I butcher names like this, I'm so sorry. <laughs> um, but the lipsticks retail for £14 each and the first one, Tsubaki, is this really beautiful brighter pink. And Kanishon, look at that. It's a really kind of petal pink. Beautiful. We have a blush. This is the Skin Kiss blush in the shade Sakura. Really beautiful soft pink. The Skin Kiss blush retails for £13. Then we have two eyeshadows. They are the Eye Perfect eyeshadows. And these retail for £12 each. I have the shade Love, which is the brighter pink. Beautiful. And I also have the shade Peace, which is a really gorgeous kind of peachy colour. And the final product in my PR package was the Madeja Lash Mascara. Look at that packaging. How beautiful is that? It just feels really luxurious. Love it. And let's have a look at the wand. Okay, so we've got the plasticky wand. My kind of wand. Perfect. And the Madeja Lash Mascara retails for £16. So let's get right on into this. So everything I have on my face will be listed in the description box below should you wish to check that out. So I think firstly I'm going to be going in with Love, the brighter pink. And I'm going to be taking that on the outer corner there and then dragging it through my crease. So just concentrating it in the outer V there. It's blending out really nicely. This is a brand I'm really excited for. Um, I love their promo videos. If, uh, if you haven't seen, you really need to check them out. They're really cool. Really, really cool. I will link the website for Madage Beauty and also the Instagram in the description box below. 
um, for you to go and check out but I highly recommend you watch the promo videos they're just beautiful really beautiful you can really see how much thought has gone into them I'm really liking how this is blending out what beautiful color I do have a code with Madage Beauty, it is just STEF10, which also will be listed in the description box below. Um, it's not affiliated, it just saves you some money. They've also partnered up with two other brands to sell their products through the website, and they are Cat King Cosmetics and ZC Cosmetics. Um, both are cruelty free and vegan, which is amazing. Um, and if I hadn't mentioned already, Madage Beauty is a cruelty free brand um, any of you who watch my videos will know I only feature cruelty free brands because we love our fairy feathered scaly friends and uh, we don't think they should suffer so that we can look beautiful yeah I'm really liking that that is blended out really nicely, there's no patchiness at all. Pigments there. That's a really pretty colour. And next we're going to be taking Peace, the lovely peachy shade. And just using a packing brush, I'm going to be packing that all over my lid. We are going for a completely matte look today. Just wanted to really kind of showcase the eyeshadows I have here. So these uh, these colours go really nice together. It's a really soft look. So just packing it all over the lid there. I'm definitely looking forward to trying these. Uh, shadows in some different shades also preferably green <laughs> not that I'm predictable at all but I do however really like these colors and just going back in with the brush that we had for love and just tapping a bit more of that on the outer edge there just to give it a bit more uh, definition and I'm just going to dip into the tiniest bit of love there and just bring that down onto the lower lash line there and then just the brush that we uh, used for piece I'm just going to take that over the edge there Just to blend that out a bit. I'm going to quickly curl my eyelashes and then we will try out the mascara. Okay, so oh, I can't get over the packaging of this. It is so beautiful. Beautiful. Right. So let's have a see. I do love the wand for this. Yeah, I have to say I'm pretty impressed. Where it's a slightly thinner wand, it's uh, easy to get the lower lashes as well. So yeah, I will have to get back to you guys on how it wears, if it smudges or anything like that. But so far, I'm pretty impressed. My lashes are a pain, an absolute pain. And uh, it's definitely done something. So yeah, so far, impressed. Right, next... We have the Skin Kiss blush and I have the shade Secure Kiss. So let's have a see. Oh, it's a very soft, very soft, pretty pink. Another interesting fact about the brand is that all of their uh, all of their products are made to order and they do this to keep their carbon footprint as 
low as possible but also their prices and that way also it means that anything you buy has not been sat on a shelf in a warehouse for months on end it's all going to be at most a handful of weeks old and it's a really pretty soft blush Put it on my nose. so I'm going to quickly nip off and do liner and lashes and then come back to try out these lip products so don't go anywhere so I went in with the Colourpop Cream Gel Liner in Peach Fuzz in my waterline. The black eyeliner is the Artitude Cosmetics Catitude Liner and Lash Adhesive in One. I love that product. Um, the lashes are also from Artitude Cosmetics and they are in the Style Doll. So firstly I just want to see how the High Shine Lip Gloss works on its own. So let's have a see. Oh yeah, it's not sticky at all. It feels really silky. Hmm. So yeah, lip gloss on its own. So if you wanted to go for a more natural look and just have the glossy lip, very nice. All right, so I've taken that gloss off and we have the two lipsticks to try. So I'm firstly going with Canishon, Canishon, however you pronounce it, I'm terrible for butchering names. So let's. It's really nice and creamy to apply. Hmm, it feels really nice. It's a really kind of moisturising lipstick, I would say. Beautiful colour. Yeah, I like that. So, let me just take this one off. And then lastly, going in with the shade Tsubaki. It's a much brighter pink, so let's see how this looks. So this one's got like more of a metallic shine to it. I really like that. Again, it feels really smooth, really moisturising on the lips. Hmm. So sorry if you can hear my cat. He is uh, meowing at the door. So let's talk first impressions. So the first thing we tried was the Lip Envy Lip Balm. It left my lips feeling really soft, really hydrated, and it smells divine. And I think you get a lot of product in there. You don't need much. First impressions, this is a, a big yes from me. What did we try next? The eyeshadows. Mr. Fluff. <laughs> so the eyeshadows, I think, pigmented, blended beautifully. I'm looking forward to trying um, more colours in these. Yeah, excited to try more of those. And then the Skin Kiss Blush in the shade Secure Kiss. It was really easy to apply. There's enough pigment, but it's buildable. It's a really pretty colour, very soft. Yeah, I think it's left a really nice flush to the skin. It was not a problem to, to blend. It just it was easy, really easy to use and a really pretty colour. The mascara, the Madeja Lash Mascara. I love the wand, absolutely love the wand. I think it's more lengthening than volumising, but it left my lashes looking quite good. So I would rarely go out and just have mascara on, but I think actually with this, I, I quite possibly might, if I'm going for a more natural look. Um, but yeah, so far, I'm pretty impressed with this also. The High Shine Lip Gloss, really smooth, really silky on the lips, really it's just, it's a beautiful clear lip gloss. I liked it. <laughs> the lipsticks 
Okay, so so the Kanishon, 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 however you pronounce it, um, is really really nice soft, soft color, and then. Subaki, obviously the shade I have on now. So yeah, I do love this uh, almost metallic looking finish. The formula of the lipsticks is really comfortable. They feel really moisturizing. It's just really comfortable. Yeah, I can definitely see me using these more, especially this one. I do love this finish. Absolutely love it. So Madage Beauty also do other products. I actually have the foundation and the concealer on its way to me to try out. Um, not in PR, I've purchased that myself. They also do a skincare range. There's a primer, BB cream, all sorts. Just head on over and have a look. There's, uh, there's a lot there. And also on the site you have the Katkin Cosmetics and ZC Cosmetics um, and the packaging on those products you really need to have a look. They are just beautiful. The kind of pieces that you want to put on display, really beautiful. So yeah, head on over and have a look. Obviously you've got the three brands on the one website to have a look at. So yeah, I do have to say that everything I have tried out, I have really, really enjoyed. I am looking forward to trying a few of the products in different shades. Um, I love that I had the more, the brighter pink to play with for the eyes and the lips. I really like, I can't get over the finish of this lipstick. Absolutely love this lipstick. This is a winner. Is it? on my lips. It's a winner. I don't know what I'm talking about. What am I talking about? The lipstick. I love it. I love it. I don't know what else to say. Yeah, I definitely think um, out of all the products that I have tried so far, this lipstick is my favourite. I absolutely love the finish of this lipstick. I have enjoyed playing with all of it. So yeah, so far I am really impressed. I will play with these products some more and give you a more solid, rounded review um, once I've trialled them out. But for first impressions, they're just really, really lovely products. The packaging I just think looks really effective. They're very simple yet effective uh, designs. And yeah, the packaging for the mascara, I don't really need to say anything. Look at that. How beautiful is that? It looks really luxurious. So guys, let me know in the comment section below what you think of this look. And are there any of the products you're interested in? Have you tried any already? Let me know in the comment section below. If you've liked this video, please give it a like, a thumbs up. It really helps me out. If you're not subscribed already, then I hope you'll consider sticking around. I am a huge lover of all things makeup, but especially colourful makeup, and I focus mainly on indie brands. So if that sounds like something that you would be interested in, then please do hit that subscribe button, and don't forget to hit the notification bell so that YouTube notifies you every time I upload. So yeah, that is it from me for today. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you are all having a great day, a great evening, wherever you are and whatever you're doing. I hope you're taking care of yourselves. I will see you again very, very soon. Goodbye.